Hello, this is a little video I decided to make to fix Air 30 on a rude furnace. Um, I checked around on the internet and I it was very difficult to find out how to fix this myself. So I'm just going to show you how to do it. Um, first thing I noticed, the furnace wasn't working and the thermostat was black. It's one of those electronic ones and it just didn't show anything. It looks like it was dead. So I come down here and I can see something blinking through the little window here at the bottom. It's blinking red. It's like, okay, so it's trying to tell me something. So come here, open up the door, pop this door off, and there's the inside of your furnace. And Oh, okay, so now it's not blinking anymore. So, what's going on with that? Oh, well, you have to hit the little, you gotta hit the little button here so it thinks the door is back on. Ah, there we go. Now we've got our code and we're blinking 30. And it turns out that means that the fuse is blown. Um. We had been doing some electrical work yesterday, so that makes sense. Somehow we shorted something out, I don't know, and the fuse burnt out on this board, which is good. You don't, you'd rather have the fuse burnt out than have the, the board have a problem, right? So I went down to the automotive store. Here's the, uh, the fuse goes right here. And I've already taken it out and looked at it and said, yep. You can you can tell by looking in the middle there that it's no longer connected. It's a number three. It's a number, it's a three amp fuse. So to replace that, I just went down to the automotive store, spent five bucks, and I got myself a bunch of three amp fuses. So in order to put the new fuse in, I'm just going to turn off the power to this thing. There we go, and it's very simple to put a fuse in. So I've got this package. And, uh, um, yeah, I got, let's see, one, two, five. I got five of these for five bucks. So it's quite a cheap and easy fix. And you can tell this fuse is a good one. You can see the little wire. Hopefully, you can see the little wire there in the middle. That means that, uh, yeah, that's a good one. And that wire is not there on the one that's blown. So, all right, we'll just plug this in where it goes on the board here. There. That's all she wrote. Put this cover back on. Turn the power back on, and let's see, well, is it going to work to be continued? Alright, this did give me an error of zero, or I don't know if, if zero is even an error, but it does say zero down there on the board. However. I have just heard the furnace start up. So that was it. It was simply a blown fuse, super easy to fix. So before, when that fuse was blown, this little thermostat <clears throat> was black. It would not come on, nothing would happen. And that's because it's powered by the furnace. And when that fuse is blown, there's no power. So as soon as I replaced the fuse, turned the power back onto the furnace, the thermostat started working, and uh, we are now heating the house again. Yay.